Mari and welcome back to my series Fix Up, Look Sharp on Video Jug and this week I'm going to be showing you how to make these beautiful embellished necklace collars. Right, for the first embellished necklace collar that I'm going to show you how to make, all you need is an old shirt. Now please don't get one of your favourites, um, just get maybe one of your father's that he's like throwing out or you've got a sibling you don't really like, you could just steal one of his because we're going to be cutting into it. No, I'm joking, we're not going to uh, steal any of your sibling's shirts, we just want an old one that is on its way out and all you'll be using anyway is the collar, so just the older the better. Um, and a pair of scissors, nice and sharp, and some studs which are in the shape of a pyramid and have two little spikes on the back. Right, first of all, what we're going to do is cut the collar off the shirt. So all we need is a good pair of fabric scissors because you'll get a really clean cut. And a little tip is to keep the first button attached to the shirt. So we'll keep that. I'm going to undo it, but I'm going to keep it when I, when I cut. So I'm going to follow the seam round, just very carefully, keeping the top hole button still. Cut round the whole shirt. And then you can throw away that shirt and you have your collar. Right, so um, as you can see, my line isn't very straight, so I'm just going to clean that up to make it look neat and tidy. Because nobody likes a jaggedy edge, do they? No. Right, so once you're happy with your edge, and it sort of looks like that, we're going to start decorating this corner of the collar. So get your studs. So I'm going to start making a line like this. So you just stick them through. Normally going quite easily. And then you just close the back pins. So then you keep going up the, the side of the collar. I'm going to try and make them, I mean you can decorate however you want, but I'm going to try and make it sort of straight lines up. So whichever design you want, you just keep going and you do it on this side and this side. And I'm just going to, it's a bit time consuming, but I'm going to keep sticking these studs in the pattern that I want. Right, so now I've uh, finished my design and whatever you've done, make sure you've pushed all your studs in really carefully because at the back you need to make sure the spikes are down because they can really hurt you if uh, they stay sticking out and that's not very nice for anybody. Um, and then you fold it over and you can actually put it on and that is your embellished collar. So there you go, a smiley little collar. Uh, now I'm going to show you a different kind of embellished collar uh, with pearl beads and sewing. Right, for your second embellished necklace collar, all you need is a shirt, some pearl beads, a needle, some cotton, and some scissors. Right, so you're going to do exactly the same as before. You're going to cut along the seam, keeping the top button in and going around the seam very neatly. Just like this. Okay, throw away the shirt. And just neaten up those edges. Right, so take your thread and your needle and uh, basically, my mum taught me this trick, if you lick the end, it should go through first time through the eye. So there we go, it's gone straight through. And then you just need to cut the end. There we go, and tie a little knot in the end to stop your beads falling off. So just tie a knot like that. And basically thread through the back. There we go really neatly to your thing, to your knot, there you go, and then thread on your beads, just like that. And then I'm going to use another one to go back through, so wherever I want it to go through, so I'm going to use it quite close, like that, just simply go through, and then back through, it's a really easy sewing technique, even your dog could do it, it's so easy. Slip it through, there you go. 
And I'm going to do a little cluster on each of the corners. It's really good to use the same colour thread so it's not visible. So with my pearls, I've gone for a white thread. Um, but you know, you might want to use wools or different cottons and just make it as bright as possible. It's entirely up to you. So I'm just going to keep going and build this up, you know, to quite a few pearls. And I'm going to do exactly the same on the other side because I want them to be uh, symmetrical. So when I pull them together, they will look the same. That's really quite important. So you just literally pull the last bead through and then to finish, if you turn onto the back, it doesn't matter that this looks messy, you won't see it. You just scoop through three or four times, not going back to the front, but just to tie, to keep it firm. And that way you won't lose any beads. And there you have it, your beautiful embroidered necklace collar with a lovely pearl finish. Beautiful. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed making these very snazzy collars. And don't forget, if you liked watching Fix Up Look Sharp, uh, you can always subscribe to Video Jug Beauty. Tune in next week when I will turn a battered old pair of heels into something very snazzy and glamorous for a night out. See you then. Bye.